Hello everyone on the internet. I'm going to teach you how to install Halo 1 on Xubuntu uh, 18.04 latest. Should work any Xubuntu. But uh, first thing you need to do is install one. Go to uh, wiki.ynhq.org slash Ubuntu and follow these instructions. So open up terminal. And I've already done it, so I'm not going to do it again. But basically just copy this line these three lines and uh, so app get update and I, I recommend staging branch you can install staging I mean any of these will work but I recommend staging so uh, once you got wine installed go to software type in wine tricks and install this so once you got wine tricks and wine installed, uh, t type in wine tricks in a terminal, and it will make your default prefix. I mean, we're literally just making a default prefix, so things will be happier later. So basically, open it and close it. And uh, what I use is something called Lutris, which is a front end for wine. Uh, Lutris. Just download Lutris again. Just follow these instructions for Ubuntu. So copy and paste all these into a terminal. And then once you install Lutris, uh, open up. Now you're going to see a bunch of. You're not going to see a bunch of games here. I've already have mine set up with an account, and you don't need to set up an account. But uh, what you want to do first off is click this uh, three gears thing, manage runners, and uh, I highly recommend if you're using Lutris to install Wine Steam first. But I mean, for this tutorial, you won't need it. What you'll need to do is go to Wine here and go to Manage Versions, and then you'll need to scroll down and go to. 3.0 i386 newer versions like some of the newer wines do not want to work with halo or halo 2 for that matter so um i know 3.0 3.0 works 3.2 might work 3.3 might work but i know 3.0 works make sure it's i386 so it's 32 bit so click the check mark you'll get the loading bar and when that's done got that set and then you, uh, well, it would help if I had the Halo files. So go ahead and download the Halo files. Uh, Halo Custom Edition setup. Uh, let's see here. Halo C setup. You'll need to set up, you'll need the. Halo C update. Halo C 1010. You'll need Halo Anti Cheat. And you'll need, uh, this is optional, but I go ahead and do this so, uh, Things look nicer. Uh, get Chimera. No, Chimera Halo. It'll be this link, but uh, go to the last page. Try to find the latest version. So not page 18 currently. Maybe page 16. Chimera, Chimera, Chimera. There you go. Chimera build. Bye.
60. I might just get a direct link to it in the video description and make it easier. Uh, yeah. So we can close that. We got, well, we almost got all the files we need. Okay, so I got all the files we need. Uh, what you're going to want to do is manually add a game. Select runner from list, line. You can put whatever name you want here, but Halo Custom Edition. Least year, fuck, I don't know. Just leave that blank. Uh, executable. Should be. Halo CE setup. Wine prefix. I like to make a new prefix, but you don't have to. Uh, I have mine dot wine games, but I'm going to create a new folder there. Let's see. Okay. So you need to set up a wine prefix. That's actually important. I like to put 32 bit here, run our options, and select 3.0 i3a6. Enable the. I don't think that should matter for Halo 1. Uh, something that will matter is a. Uh, Use XVID mode to switch resolutions. This will be very, very important if you want to, you know, not play in a window. Uh, and system options. Okay, nothing to do there. So save there. Uh, where's my Halo Custom Edition? Okay, there it is. Uh, you want to go to. Wine tricks. Set default prefix, install Windows DLL or component. You need a few things here. You need all DirectX 9 DLLs. Just select all of these. Uh, what else do you need? You need MFC 42, otherwise the installer will not work. You need, fuck, I don't remember, MSX ML. MSX ML3, I think, or is it 4? I think 4 will work. It, you need one of these, otherwise your in-game text chat won't work. And uh, you also need VC Run 2010 for Halo Anti-Cheat to work. Should be it. So click OK and, click OK and wait for it to uh, start doing stuff. Or just pop up the window again. Let's see if it actually did it. Uh, installed those. Installed that. Installed that. And installed that. Okay. So it actually did it. Close all this and start this. Except that you'll uh, put in your key. Eh, fuck it. Uncheck un install Games by Arcade. It's useless. Uh. 
and close all this. Right click Halo Custom Edition and click Run EXE inside Wine Prefix. You'll this is when you this is when you'll need to run your update. So Halo C patch 10.10. Okay, game successfully updated. Now, uh, those two extra DLL files, we'll need to put them in the Halo directory under controls. So, uh, let me get to my downloads. Uh, where the hell is. Okay, there's hack. Loader.dll. And then there should be like a. Chimera, yeah. Chimera.dll and loader.dll. Cut or copy, and then go to your prefix. Uh, this is kind of like a virtual Microsoft Drive thing. So controls here, paste. Okay, so your directory is all set now. Uh, all you gotta do now is right click this, go back to configure, go to game options and change your executable to the one in your prefix. So uh, you go back to your prefix. Microsoft Games, Halo Custom Edition, Halo CE.exe. Save and if we cross our fingers, hopefully everything should work. Let's see here. It, it, it looks like it's working. So yeah, of course. Of course, there's uh, some other stuff you'll want to do. For example. To get better animations, type in Chimera Interpolate nine, not eight, nine. 